find a set of loads at the ceiling equivalent to the loads shown. So in this case what you have is a 30 newton load to the left and a 20 newton kil kilonewton load to the right. A 40 kilonewton meter moment here at the tip of the beam. The beam is four meters long. I want to find a set of loads at the ceiling that's the same as my loads here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on the ceiling a force in the x direction, a force in the y direction, and a moment at the wall. These are not reaction moments. These are the equivalent loads. So I want to have my old equal to my new. If I take the sum of the forces in the x direction on my original system, I have not 30, but 0.03, because I'm dealing with kilonewtons, to the left plus 20 to the right. Now here I've got positive going to the right for my sum of the forces in x. Same positive going to the right, my sum of the forces in x looks like fx, set the old equal to the new. Sum of the forces in y, I have no forces in the y direction on my original old system. This is the old system, this is the new system. My new system has a force in the y that would be Fy positive up, so Fy has to be equal to zero. If I take the sum of the moments, you may take the sum of the moments anywhere you'd like, but a convenient place would be to take it at the wall. In my old system, I have 0 0.03 newtons acting at 2 meters, which tends to spin the wall clockwise. I have 20 kilonewtons acting at 4 meters, tending to spin the wall counterclockwise. And I have 40 kilonewton meters all by itself, which tends to spin the wall count, uh, clockwise. Those are my three loads at the wall. In my new system, at the wall, Fy and Fx go through the wall and do not contribute a moment at the wall, but I have my moment, which I've defined here as counterclockwise. Now on the left, I've got positive numbers for things that are going clockwise. On the right hand, I need to still have positive numbers for things that are going clockwise. So the way I wrote this down, that has to be a negative number for old equals new. This is the old system and the new system. As long as the loads are the same in both cases, you can say that these are an equivalent system. So Fx equals 19.97 kilonewtons to the right, Fy is 0 newtons or kilonewtons up, and the moment from the equivalent system is 39.94 kilonewton meters counterclockwise. These signs are determined by the diagram I made for my new. This system is equivalent to the one I had before.